Check sprayer for damage and leak by spraying using clean water. Repair leak immediately if leakage exists. It is vital to fix all the leak before using the mist blower in order to avoid any contamination as well as for safety precaution. During the application of herbicide using the net set mist blower, the most important step is to wear a complete set of PPE. PPE used to protect our body from any contamination either water or chemical. The sprayer should be carried on the bed and operated by pumping while directing the nozzle at the height mean of for the target. To reduce the contamination of herbicide, spray the knapsack mist blower in downwind position in order to avoid drift and always keep the constant height because it can maintain the best field practices. Firstly, you need to fill the sprayer with water and pump it to working pressure. Dip nozzle into bucket and spray water into container for precisely 1 minute. Measure the quantity of water collected in graduated cylinder and repeat this calibration at least 3 times to obtain the average nozzle discharge per minute. Mark the starting point with a step in the field or on empty ground. The sprayer should be carried on the back and operated by pumping while directing the nozzle at the high mean for the target. Walk for exactly one minute for someone else with the time on the board. Walk at a normal and constant speed. Mark the ending point with another step and measure the distance between the starting and end point. Repeat this action three times to obtain average walking speed. The width of the next set mist blower sword also needs to be measured. If the spray is managed in a swinging pattern, the sword width is the distance between the art edges.